Well, we are now just one day away from the big game for the Montana Grizz men's basketball team as they'll be looking to hang tough with the three seed Michigan Wolverines. Our sports director Derek Berkeley has been traveling with the team all week and now joins us live from Des Moines. Derek. Yeah, thanks, Jack. A second straight year, the Montana Grizzlies have made it to the NCAA tournament thanks to the play of stars like Michael Ogine and Ahmad Rory, as well as head coach Travis DeCure. But there are a few other guys who remain in the shadows that have also played a big part in the success. Montana's assistant coaches are having just as much fun as everyone else. As a kid, you grow up and you dream about being a part of the NCAA tournament. Um, so now to be here and for year two is, is sometimes it's hard to like wrap your mind around, to be honest with you. This group has stayed together for the past three years, so associate head coach Chris Cobb and assistants Jay Flores and Rashi Wortham have settled into their roles. I love the, the fact when guys come out of a game to be able to talk to them about what they saw, how they, how they operate, what I see. I try to give a lot of positive energy um, on the bench, you know, try to encourage the guys. Some head college coaches run their programs like dictatorships, and Travis DeKeer does outwardly show the signs of an intense perfectionist, but his assistants praise the way he uses authority. I know Travis has been a really, really good coach. He was my AAU coach, so I knew that uh, his track record. It's phenomenal, to be honest with you, just in terms of the fact that he creates an environment that allows us as assistant coaches to be who we are. Montana has won more games these past two seasons than any other two-year stretch in program history. The men in the background working every day to help make this run understand this team is special. I'm telling you, if you have good people that are willing to do whatever, you have a chance to succeed. But on top of that, Coach DeCure applies pressure every single day, so people understand that they got to they got to push themselves to win. I feel like this group is able to, for the most part, get along really well. And uh, when you have success and you're enjoying it, you're able to enjoy it around people that you care about. I think it makes it even more fun. Now, while they continue to have fun as a group, they're also still very hard at work. When I asked the assistant coaches about this upcoming matchup, they talked about how daunting it is to prepare for a team as good as Michigan. But there is a ton of confidence on this Montana Grizzly team, as I've heard all day long, and they feel like they could make some history and pull off the upset and get the team's first win in the NCAA tournament since 2006. We'll have much more on the matchup with the Wolverines coming up on the 10 o'clock news tonight. Live in Des Moines, Derek Berkeley, MTN Sports.